Hey everybody, so quick video. I wanted to try this little hack I seen where you put like nail polish in the monomer and it's like tinted, right? So you just use your regular old clear powder and it like tints it like you used to color acrylic. So I was like, this could be good because um nail polish is like a dollar. And y'all know it's like takes up a lot of space and like a lot of money to get a whole bunch of gel or like even gel polish, like gel polishes and um colored acrylics it's a lot so I saw a couple of videos and I was like I'm gonna try it so the first little swatchy swatch I did there it was like too sheer like I wanted it the color of that nail polish right so I could kind of tell from the jump something was going on y'all like you see I keep wiping off my brush it was sticky my brush was sticky it was like sticking everything and then it was drying super fast like I couldn't get it off the brush onto there without it just kind of not even drying it was like sticking I don't know and I was like, it's probably not going to have enough strength at all. Kind of like, you know, colored acrylic and stuff. You put clear powder on top of it. Just So I was going to do that, but with regular liquid. So as you can see, I'm trying to really work with it. And it's literally drying before I could like put it on the nail. It's like, I don't know. I probably didn't put too much nail polish, but I wanted to have that same opacity that it had in the bottle. You know what I'm saying? Like, what's the point of having it share? I did see it work with, if you want to do like a jelly nail and you put like a little bit of nail polish just to get like that sheerness, that works really well. But if you want it to be super opaque and stuff, y'all don't do this. <laughs> I'm going to spoil it right now. It was a fail. It was a fail. Probably if you put a lot less in there, it's just the ratios off in order for you to get the color that you want unless you have a super pigmented polish maybe and you just use a dab of it but I feel like you would need a good amount to get the you know color if y'all have tried this let me know because it was a straight up fail like I, <laughs> it was a fail I was really like onto something I was like oh if this works like I love colored acrylic so you know I don't have every shade every you know I do mix up colors and stuff but sometimes you just want to you know have it on hand and I was like yo these nail polishes are like a dollar at the dollar tree these days like nail polishes are pretty cheap because I feel like everybody uses gel polish that the regular polishes are pretty cheap unless you get OPI or China Glaze do they still sell them I haven't bought nail polish in forever and this is an old nail polish too like I said I haven't bought nail polish in forever so maybe it's old I don't know you saw I had to shake it at the beginning so, I don't know, but I saw some people do it and it worked, but it's just the strength isn't there. It's super sticky, super messy. Look at that paper towel. Look at it. Look how dirty. Girl. Girl. It's... <laughs> My brush is sticky. The paper towel is filthy. It's just... Girl. I don't know about this. I don't know. But I saw people on the YouTube say it worked. I don't even know. And yeah, I just poured all that out. That's why I used a little, um, little container because I did not want to mess up my pour, like pour out a whole bunch of monomer and waste it. So I used my little jar and I put my brush in the brush cleaner cause it was so sticky. I had to clean it first. Like it's like you wasting time at this point. Like, huh. but that's, you know, just the right, that's usually the jar that I use for my monomer. And I'm going to do it the same way. And before I used regular clear acrylic powder on the first one. So I'm still using the clear, but I'm using it with regular uh, nail liquid. Don't ask me which one. I've been playing with different ones. So one of them, girl, one of them. But yeah, just putting a layer on top. But see, it's not drying too fast or nothing like that. Like it was before with the... um. <laughs> I was over here trying to see like yo is it even set like it was bending like uh uh <laughs> it was like the ratio was off maybe you could get the ratio to monomer to nail polish right but are you gonna get it right every time if that's like your go-to thing to do I don't know at this point y'all it's just like I don't want to get every color powder and I don't want to get every color um gel polish either but at this point I don't know but y'all, I was filing and I was like, girl, I ain't even going to keep going. Look at that. Look. <laughs> Don't, it was a fail, y'all. If y'all have any tips, because I be seeing people do it. But look at, girl. It's, girl. I don't know. 
let me know if y'all have tried it and what I did wrong. <laughs> Bye.